Hi everyone and welcome to today's news update. I'm going to go over new and updated articles over on Max Roll for the Vaulton patch as well as a possible solution for error code 1101. First post of the day by user Perkiculum who is also very active over on Max Roll and part of the team there. In this Reddit post he shows us that Max Roll has stocked up on guides in regards to Vaulton phase 1 and phase 2 as well as Descaluda. They also created destroyer build guides and updated some resource articles. On top of that they created more GVG content. As always guys you can find the links to everything that I'm talking about down in the description below and when you're down there make sure to like the video and subscribe to this YouTube channel. That would help me out a lot. Thank you guys so much. Next up user Spooksin has created a thread over on the official Lost Ark forums titled Carrying People for Gold Generating VAC Ban. In this post user Spooksin is detailing that he has been banned for carrying people for gold and was asking for clarification for that ban. Rox replied with we have been able to resolve this as a mistake was made to clear any confusion. Charging for carries in-game will not lead to a ban, so long as all transactions take place completely within the game and there is no RMT involved. As an additional note, don't always recommend it, because we can't regulate whether a player decides to hold up to their end of the deal or not, but these exchanges alone are not bannable offenses. So this post by Rox legitimizes carrying players in-game for in-game currency. Another post over on the official forum has been created that is called Any Chance for Patch Notes Tomorrow. Rox replied in that thread with I would expect full notes to come in fairly close to the patch as there is a lot of ground to cover and loads of information coming in. But the patch will happen at the standard downtime on Thursday. Another great heads up by user Malek Bar over on Reddit that says just an FYI, you need to have killed Velganos at least one time before the new Guardian Descaluda becomes accessible to you. There is also great tips in that Reddit thread. One of those is you don't need to harvest the soul of Velganos to actually be able to enter Descaluda. So if you were saving rest bonus at the moment, you can just go kill Velganos and Descaluda will become available to you as soon as it's out on Thursday while not consuming one of your rest bonuses. You also only need to do this on one character to unlock Descaluda for your whole account. I have seen several posts regarding the error code 1010 and user Mildrage over on Reddit has a possible solution for you guys. The TLDR to this is disable safe browsing from your ISPN settings. If you want to know how to do this, make sure to check the links in the description below. Let's have a quick look at the player numbers. The 24 hour peak has increased by 71,000 players and it looks like that the numbers are now back to where we were before a lot of bots have been yeeted out of Lost Ark. If you guys want to know how to end the discussion when it comes to Northeast, Southwest or X3, make sure to check out this video and I'll see you next time.